We are going to sit at the Asia's top highest ropeway at 14,500 feet. Are you excited? Oh, shit. <laughs> ready to move out to Hatula right now. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Me, it's only me and Timon right now because the others are still sleeping. We are going, going to Galambung first to drop the car, which we got it from right down the boat, the next one car. So we're we'll going to advance and go down to NGV. Go start on you and I. Good to go. Let's move on. Uncivilized person right there being just right outside. Proper toilet down there. Right? Yeah. So everybody was holding a phone, even if there was a signboard where there was, not, uh, they were not allowed to take videos and pictures. So the tourists must know that they should follow the rules and regulation properly. Where did you win? Everything here is frozen. <laughs> I did the was that? So we are about to sit in a cable car right now. Are you excited? Very much excited. This is our first time. We are going to sit at the Asia's top highest ropeway at 14,500 feet. So we're having samosa right now, me and Jello. And we just met him. He is in the next cabin, but he just came and sit with us. So we are on our way to Dimapu right now. We have, we have been waiting for the train from last night. It has been delayed for two hours. Dimapur wants to Four of them is leaving to Kohima right now. Me, them, sir, will leave to Mokuchong only tomorrow. Had a great time. They're leaving to Kohima now. Oh, sorry. Until we meet again. Until we meet again. I won't. Uh, no. Bye bye.
Tunggu gue. Tunggu gue gila. Ini dia. So that is how we wind up our very trip to Sikkim. So happy yet so sad that it had to be the last day together. Before I end this video, I want to rewind everything back to how it started and how it has ended. Just like Uti Kuti had messaged everybody in our last day with the most heart touching line. So I want to elaborate more with those lines and this is how it goes. We traveled 5-6 hours just to enjoy the mesmerizing and captivating view for just 30 minutes which was the maximum time we had been unloaded but we had to return back to the base for another location tiresome not satisfied yet that was the best part of the adventure this whole part of the story started in Kohima Lear Colony where random conversation among friends became a reality thank you Timur for being the best host and collector making all necessary arrangements so that we can all have a good time Udi Tubes being Udi Tubes, the eldest in the crew yeah! <laughs> the one who did what he had promised the you see me link the next episode well you see me link the next episode always ready to give up his comfort so that others are going good in Sashi we had discovered a lot of things besides singing his laughter is at its best <laughs> and not forgetting the second loudest snorer. Ukulima being the only dad in the group, always thoughtful. And no, no, no. <laughs> you know that. Sungjim always does what he does best giving unnecessary comments, and he's always ready to cancel every train ticket. Dempsey and I being the youngest in the group. Them still always entertaining and always making fun of me <laughs> and always preparing to talk in front of the camera. Udia Longor eventually won the snoring competition. Though Sashi and Temsu were not so less, give it up for the Udia, who also took the front seat just to sleep and snore. I wish I had taken a video of that but I couldn't. Not forgetting Utikuti, who is the shortest, the strongest, and also the smartest who knows almost everything this was his second visit to Sikkim but I bet this was also the best because we were there with him mm, the most unplanned unorganized successful trip ever to those of you who are watching if you had enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe it would really mean a lot until then I, I will see you guys later until then be safe just be happy and smile